In CTEC ERP, basic parts items are called PRC parts. A PRC part is a combination of PRC, product code, plus part number. PRC is a unique, three character code required by CTEC ERP for your internal item numbers. The intended use of the PRC code smart naming scheme is for product segmentation and categorization. Together, PRC, product code, plus part number form a PRC part. You will be able to show, hide PRC, part number, and or PRC part on any customer or vendor interfacing documents. You do have the choice to not create PRC codes. In this case, the system will split each part number. The part numbers can then be combined manually on all interfacing docs. How do you create a new PRC code in CTEC? The first step is to open CTEC ERP and click Parts. Click Lists. Click PRC List. Click Create PRC. Type in your new three-letter PRC code. I chose FIG to stand for Finished Good. But you can decide the naming scheme that makes most sense for your company. Click Create. On this pop-up screen, you can enter more information about your new PRC code, like its default vendor, if applicable. Its revenue G, L account. Shipping, packing instructions, etc. When you are done entering information, click Update. To see a list of all of your PRC codes, go to Parts, Lists. And click PRC List. To see the full list, don't enter anything in the search fields. Just click Submit. The PRC list report shows you valuable information, like the number of parts to which each PRC code is assigned, and the value of those parts. Here you can see that the new PRC code we inputted has been added to, to the list. Let's see this new PRC code in action. Let's say you want to create a new part. Go to Parts, Lists. Click Part List. Click Create New. Now you can see that our new PRC code, FIG, is available to assign to a new part. Now you have a better understanding of PRC codes in CTEC. For more information, go to ctecerp.com and search for PRC in the upper right-hand global search bar.